Margo? I need to borrow your car. What? I have nine things I need to do tonight, and more than half of them require a getaway driver. Well, the writer who gave us the bestseller, The Fault in Our Stars, has another story that's playing out on the big screen. Paper Towns opens in theaters this weekend. Lauren sat down with author John Green and two of the actors when they made a stop in North Texas last week. Welcome to Dallas. Thank, hey. you. Thank you. It was a quick stop in Dallas for two of the stars of the new movie Paper Towns and the man who wrote the best-selling novel. We let people vote to decide where we're going to come. Uh, and this year, Texas was, was one of the most voted states for paper Texas towns. Texas loves John. Well, I don't, maybe they love you now. Maybe Texas they love both me. of us. Yeah. The new film adaptation is about a young man called Q, played by Nat Wolf, who goes in search of his neighborhood and childhood love interest. He learns a lot along the way. You're a ninja, too. It's a really awkward one. I can feel my heart beating in my chest. That's how you know you're having fun. Uh. When we were on the set of The Fault in Our Stars, um, when we were filming that movie, uh, which was also adapted from a book of mine, I uh, kept leaning into the producers and saying, you know what you guys should do? You should make a movie from Paper Towns. You know who should play Q? Nat Wolf. You know what you guys should do? You should make a movie from Paper Towns. And, and Nat, Nat Wolf should play Q. And it totally worked. It worked. <laughs> Brainwashed. So when you heard about that, that he was going to be doing this, or was hopefully going to be doing this, were you totally on board? I read uh, Paper Towns for the first time, and I just fell in love with it. And then a couple months later, yeah, they called me and said, do you want to play the lead in Paper? I was like, yes. You guys have a huge following already, and the movie's not even out yet. Hi. Morgan. Oh, hi. <laughs> it's so crazy. It's so fun. And, and to see them all excited about the movie. They're just such big fans of the book. So what's in your head now? Like, what's the next book movie? Oh, I wish I knew. Um, I haven't written a book in a, in a few years, and I think I might have forgotten how to do it. I'm trying. Uh, I'm trying to, but uh, every time I'm, I'm like, uh, I'll never write another book because uh, I completely forget how to do it each time. But I'm, uh, yeah. So I'm trying to write, and uh, hopefully I'll finish something soon. Okay, you guys gonna get Mexican food while you're here? Check out oh, yeah. the sites. I think so. Yeah, we're we, That's we don't my have favorite. A, <laughs> we don't have a ton of time. Um, unfortunately, like everywhere we go, we have to see. There's uh, always time for Mexican food, John. Thank you. There's always time for some Tex Mex food, so we'll definitely get some. I have to agree. There's always time. You can always make time. Paper Towns is uh, out in theaters today. It's rated PG-13. You can find a link with more information on the film on our website, fox4news.com.